This is Bedrock, county seat of Cobblestone County. 200 feet below sea level, population 2,500. Even though Bedrock is an average Stone Age town, the wheel isn't the only invention. The citizens of Bedrock have many modern conveniences. Bedrock has plenty of stores, such as the supermarket, the butcher, the baker, and the pizza pie maker. Bedrock is a modern Stone Age city with many forms of transportation and many ways for Fred and Barney to get to work. There's a subway, Pebble Street next stop, a city bus, a railroad, and of course, the super highway. No, no, wait! Which would be useless without the invention of the horn. Uh, uh, or the traffic light. And here's our chance. Stone Age transportation is highly advanced with the invention of the four-engine jet. Fire engine one. Fire one. Here she comes, Barney! Do you think that's safe, Fred? Of course. These modern planes fly with only two bikes, if necessary. Unlike the modern jet, the family sedan is easy to work on. The Frenus pen's connected to the thingamajig. The doohickey is connected to the Frenus pen. Some even credit Barney Rubble with building the first flying machine. We ought to drop the bowling balls. Yeah, on your head. It's a little cut your arms up and down. You mean like this? <laughs> The citizens of Bedrock had many modern ways to communicate. There are plenty of telephones, a switchboard operator... I'm sorry, Mr. Slabside is busy. Will you leave a message, please? ...and voicemail. Are there any messages? This is JL speaking. The Flintstones get their information from many different sources, such as the Sunday paper. Did you get your paper, dear? Yeah. And I'm lucky. It only comes once a week. The radio. We interrupt this program to bring you a flash from Holly Rock. A mail system. Airmail. Airmail. Okay, okay. Do you have to yell? And of course, the ever popular television Good set. Good evening, friends. This is your mystery hour. Barney! Of course, television isn't the only form of entertainment in Bedrock. Fred and Barney love to play golf. He hit that one real fast. <laughs> they like to listen to records. Hold it, Mac. Thanks. Don't mention it. They love to play pinball. <laughs> and go to amusement parks. How's the air up there, girls? It's getting thin, Fred. Just like my patient. And of course, the boys love to go bowling. <laughs> You're the greatest, Fred. And why not get a refreshing drink from the Stone Age vending machine? But before Fred and Barney can go bowling, they have to do the household chores. And don't forget to clean up afterwards. Fred and Barney aren't the only ones doing the chores around the house. On the domestic side, Wilma and Betty also make use of many modern conveniences. I'm catching up on some of my sewing. <laughs> a vacuum cleaner. A juicer. I don't know what we housewives would do without a good waste disposal. And a washing machine. And of course, no modern Stone Age household would be complete without the barbecue grill. You know, I was just thinking. I have a kitchen full of the latest gadgets, and here I am out in the yard cooking the way they did a hundred years ago. Yes, Bedrock is a modern Stone Age city. What's that? Some kind of a gadget? <laughs> With its elevators. Good morning, Mr. Rabo. Take me up fast, will you, Lester? Hey, Bill, take us up to the fifth floor. Right, Les. Giddy up, Matilda! Indoor plumbing. Oh. <laughs> police department. Fire department. 
The building of the city of Bedrock itself would have been impossible without this highly specialized construction equipment. this advanced technology, Bedrock is a modern city, a model for things to come. <laughs>